Hello and welcome to the Bosch Kitchen. Today's recipe is a really tasty, healthy, fresh dish, perfect for sunny weather. It's asparagus and herb taboule, and the first thing that we're gonna do is cook some bulgur wheat. Add some bulgur wheat to a saucepan. Add in a big pinch of salt, cover with cold water, turn on the heat, bring to the boil, and simmer for 15 minutes until tender. So our bulgur wheat is bubbling away beautifully, and now this is the prime time for us to cook our asparagus. Super simple process, but really effective, and this is probably the best way to get the most out of those fantastic asparagus spears. Pop your asparagus in a baking tray. Sprinkle over your sunflower seeds. Drizzle over some olive oil. Sprinkle over a good pinch of salt. A decent pinch of pepper. And pop these under a hot grill for five minutes, turning halfway through. So now our asparagus and sunflower seeds are cooking away in the oven, it's time for us to crack on with our tabbouleh. And we're gonna start with some lemon juice. Squeeze the juice of one and a half lemons into a mixing bowl. Now add your red onion, sprinkle over your razel hanout, and a big pinch of salt. Now we're gonna get our hands dirty. We're gonna squeeze all of that lemon juice and that red onion and that razel hanout together in order to start pickling the red onion. Okay, so that red onion is smelling amazing. The lemon has started to pickle it. And what we've got here is some medjool dates. Add some coriander, parsley, and mint, and mix it all together. Make sure that those medjool dates are all broken up because they can be quite sticky. All right, that is looking really, really tasty. It smells delicious. It's high time that we crack on with our dressing. So the dressing we're about to make is super simple, but sometimes simple is the best way. We've got some vegan yogurt, a little spot of tahini, a splash of water, some salt, and a nice big pinch of pepper. Stir everything around until it's nice and smooth. So that's our dressing done. Time to assemble our salad. Add the bulgur wheat to a serving bowl. Now add your chickpeas, a generous pinch of salt, a good pinch of pepper, and a glug of olive oil. Give that a mix. Add your fresh ingredients to the grains. And again, give this a nice, good mix, making sure all the elements are well combined. Right, so our tabbouleh is looking really good. Time for us to serve up. Oh, just look at that tabbouleh, so healthy. That bulgur wheat is cooked perfectly. The chickpeas are super full of protein and absolutely delicious. Oh, look at that asparagus. It's so easy to make and it's just fantastically well cooked. All you need is a little grill, a little bit of olive oil, and there it is, cooked to perfection. Drizzle over that fantastically simple sauce, sprinkle over some pomegranate seeds, and what you have there is a fantastic bowl of food. Right, time to give this a whirl. Mm. Oh my goodness, the textures are fantastic. You've got nice chunky chickpeas that have got all that protein. You've got that lovely bulgur wheat which is cooked to perfection. It's got like a really nice bounce to it. The flavours are amazing. The Ras El Hanout and the lemon from that red onion just work perfectly. Those really nice big chunks of medjool dates have just given it a sweetness, but also an earthiness. So, so good. The asparagus is cooked perfectly. That is the perfect thing to eat on a summer's evening. Now, if you enjoyed the video, let us know what you think about it in the comment section below. Keep your eyes peeled for more content coming your way real soon, and we shall see you again next time.